you know, life and death in the power of your tongue. I was watching something the other day with, with some big dogs, and I said I had this muzzle, this leather muzzle, and strapped the dog on monster, no? Big, powerful, but a man strap on a big muscle, muzzle on him when they carry him to the vet. I've seen him by the vet by Fiona too. And they put a muzzle on the mouth of the dog to keep his mouth from opening. And I wonder how many believers Satan have muzzles on. Hello? Remember, I can't see what you're thinking now. The only thing, the only way I can know what you're struggling with in here is if you open up here and let it out so I can see it. But if this muzzle, when you're in combustion, Javier, that when the pressure in the engine build up, build up, and the inner hand outlet forget out through the muffler. Hello? The pressure inside building up, building up, building up, building up. I want you to promise me to pray for this nation, to pray for our schools, pray for children. Because as I watch and study different things, there's a case right now being tried, I think, called the Parkland shooting trial in Orlando, where she killed 17, he wounded 17 more. Real young guy, they caught him alive. It's being tried right now, I think, in Orlando. And when you watch all these school shootings, and don't think it can happen in Antigua, no? If not for us praying the Javier and going on crying out to God for this nation, no? It can happen right here. And I watch that. I watch parents come up and testify about the phone call they get from the school. Say, hi, what happened? Johnny, if you get the lunch kit, Johnny dead. Parents talk about empty bed. That every time they think they get together, they pass the bedroom and see one time, and memory come back, and they broke down again. But one of the things in all these cases, these children that, did, that do these murders, progressively plan them out, the hatred build up, and all the while, the parents say, we had no idea what they were thinking. We have become masters of subduing our thoughts where something can build up, build up, build up, build up, plan up everything. And at the same time, David said, this poor man cried. Some of our, I'm a private person, that privacy, and even the part of something people want you to discern if you're spiritually you're supposed to know me, you go through. Hmm? Hello? Look within me, Pastor. And... Me and him, God. If you're struggling, say, Pastor, here, I need to pray. Right on mine all over the place. If you want to bust my husband's head, but I'm asking the Lord to keep me. Hello? 